Hi, it's T with T Quilts, and I'm here to do a stamping up haul. I have become a stamping up demonstrator, and I know this channel is about quilting, but I also post other crafts and things on my channel. So I thought that I would start off with my stamping up haul. If you are interested in purchasing any of the stamping up projects, I'll have a link down in the description box to my stamping up page and would appreciate your patronage. So I have a lot of items. When you sign up to be a Stamping Up demonstrator, you actually receive $125 worth of product for $99. And then they also this time threw in a couple of stamp sets for free as a special during the celebration. And with tax, I've spent $107.03 on these items and I already opened the box and saw that they also threw in another free item so we'll get to that I have my order list on my clipboard and I am going to actually be marking off items as I take them out so I've already opened the boxes I've just taken the plastic bubbles off the top they do have an inventory sheet in here but I'm actually going to use the one that I use for ordering to make sure that I have everything and then I'll double check it with that sheet later so I have new demonstrator kit is in here. So let's just start with that. So this box has, looks like eight catalogs in it. So other items in the demonstrator startup kit is the celebration catalogs and it's eight of those i have eight celebration reward catalogs these are the things that you get for free if you purchase fifty dollars in product now through march 31st then i've got invitations for a hostess to give out for coming to a party. This is the be the start of something amazing brochures to give out to potential demonstrators I come across. And I've got stamping success quarter one of 2018 just gives you ideas for projects that you can use in your classes. This is all of the business information, the invoices, demonstrator folders, and some envelopes. Okay, so all of the items that I just showed you were free from Stampin' Up. In addition to that, they also sent me a paper pumpkin kit. It's actually the June 2017 kit. And I will do a separate video on the paper pumpkin kit but basically it is a paper crafting subscription you get a box monthly for about twenty two dollars with tax and I'll talk about that later so the two free stamp sets that I got you got to actually choose your stamp sets two stamp sets that I got for free that I did not pay for were a little wild and I liked it because it had the animals and then had the reverse sides of the animals and I have it in the clear stamps and I'll do a separate video on how I set up my stamps as well and then this one is jar of love and these are the photopolymer stamps And I did buy the dies that go with these, but I purchased those in a separate order. So those were free. And then the items that I purchased for my $125 in product 
which is why I wanted to, um, which is why I signed up as a Stampin' Up! demonstrator because had I purchased all of this outright, I would have spent about $325 and then I wouldn't have gotten any of the free items that I've been showing you and then there are more free items that are coming as well. So, what I got in this order was two sets of stamping pads. I've got the classic pads in Regal's and the classic pads in the Bright's collection. So when you open these up, you have 10 stamping pads. And I'll just quickly run through the colors that are in here. Have tangerine, pumpkin pie, daffodil delight, Bermuda Bay, Melon Mambo, Regal Red, Rich Razzleberry, Pacific Point, Tempting Turquoise, and Old Olive. So all 10 of those are in one box. And then in the second box, we have In the Regals collection, Garden Green, Always Artichoke, Island Indigo, Night of Navy, Eggplant, Elegant Eggplant, Perfect Plum, Cajun Craze, Rose Red, Crushed Curry, and the last one is Cherry Cobbler. So those 10 were in the Regals collection. And the final item that I actually purchased with my $125 worth of credit, which I got right on the nose by purchasing these two sets of stamps. And then I bought two packages of the foam dimensionals these are used when you want to make shaker cards so those four items were $125 that I got for $99 but paid $107 and three cents with tax so that is it in one box when you place your demonstrator order you cannot add any additional items that I that order has to be under $125 so then I went and started placing my other order because I still needed more stamping pads that I did not get in the demonstrator order. So the second box, I don't have it all sorted out, but I did order the remaining stamping pads that I needed. So I've got the end colors for 2016-18 and those are, let me move that. Dapper Denim, Emerald Envy, Peekaboo Peach, Flirty Flamingo, and Sweet Sugar Plum. Now, for some reason, the end colors did not come in a box, so that was five of those. And I guess I should have been putting prices on things as I put them up, but that was $27.50 for five pads. They're actually cheaper to buy in sets than to buy singularly because they're $7 a stamp pad otherwise. And then I also bought the 2017-2019 in colors. This is Powder Pink. This is Lemon Lime Twist. Berry Burst. Fresh Fig. And Tranquil Tide. And again, these five pads were $27.50. The next set of pads that I bought was the Classic Stamping Neutrals. This one has six stamp pads and it costs $32.50. And it actually comes in a box, the Neutrals. So in the box, I have Chocolate Chip. Soft Suede, Smoky Slate, Early Espresso, 
Sahara I Sahara Sand. And the last one in this box is Crumb Cake. So that's a total of 36 stamping pads at this point. And then the last one I bought for number 37 is Basic Black. I bought it solo and it costs $7. So for $42.25, I bought the Bondor bundle. I bought it in the clear, which for stamping up, clear means your regular red stamp that's not mounted on wood. So I bought that cane. So you get it also at 10% cheaper if you buy it as a set as compared to buying them individually. And so here are the sliding door framelits. And so I'll be doing some videos on some of these things. So we'll be coming back to these. So that's one set that I purchased. Next up is envelope paper. And I purchased the 2015 to 2017 in color. And then I also purchased the 2016 2018 in color. So here are the 2015 2017 in colors. So they're 12 by 12 papers. And they are two sided. And they're calling these envelope papers. I guess because you can make your envelopes with them, they are a little thinner. So it looks like I have two of each sheet. And there are 24 in a pack. So this was in the clearance section. And it costs $3.30. So I could choose to make envelopes with these or I can just use them for regular paper on top of my cards. So next up is the 2016-2018 envelope papers. And these have some more dots on top. So here is pinks. Chevron, so they're different colors, but the same patterns, I think. Oranges. of those okay so again this pack was three dollars and thirty cents it's actually in the clearance section so for these two stamp sets here that I got free in my business pack I actually purchased the dies that go with it so I have everyday jars that goes with the jar of love the everyday jars cost $33 for the framelits. And then for the little while, it's called Little Loves Framelits. So I got that as well to go with this set. So, so far I have three complete sets of stamps and dies. So the final item that I paid for in this order came in a separate box. And I will dump it out just to show you what it is. But it's the actual stand that you put your stamping pads in. And so it also came with a hook and some instructions for how to put the caddy together. So I will just pull this aside and I'll do a separate video on this as well. That cost $60 for the caddy. So because of celebration, for every $50 that you spend, you get free items. My order totaled $263.35. So for every $50, I got something free. The first thing I got is the Tutti Frutti cards and envelopes. 
So this was free in the celebration. It's just various different colors of note cards and the matching envelopes. And these can be dressed up or down depending on what you want to do with them. So I thought that would be a good thing to get. I also got the card kit mixed medallions. It's in this box here. And let's open it as well. So it has various different things in here, a stamp set, some dimensionals, everything you need to put together. I think it's 20 cards if I recall correctly and it even has a ink pad. I got the Thin Lits Celebrate You and I haven't opened these packets so we'll be doing a little bit more with these and as I work on these I will give, you know, show you the actual products. And then I got the wood stamp set, Amazing You. So this is all the lettering that are in here, plus these two flowers and sun rays. And this one is actually to be wood mounted. So the items that I just showed you were free because of the celebration orders. And now when you buy from Stamping Up and you start to spend $150, they give you dollar amounts that you can use to buy other items with so these items were free but they were because these were the regular things that you would get for free not because of the celebration sale so the first thing that i got was embossing paste and i actually got the silver and i'm not going to open that got the card kit called lots of happy so you can make the cards that are shown here on the cover. The embossing paste is normally $9. The card kit Lots of Happy is normally $35. I got some paper clips. They were $2.20. They were in the clearance section. And I actually purchased two of these. They're little bowl clips. So I thought they were really pretty little bowls. I hope you can see that. It doesn't really say on the packaging how many are included, but it's quite a few and I actually bought two of those. And then I still had a few dollars in my cart. So I bought another of the 2016, 2018 paper packs. And I just saw in the box of the, the, my actual order box, not in the demonstrator order box that Stamping Up is celebrating their 30th anniversary. And they sent me a free Stamping Up 30th anniversary pin. So that was it for this Stamping Up order. I think I mistakenly told you the wrong total for this order. I actually paid $256.62 for this order. So... The only other thing that I needed was to purchase some items I needed off of Amazon. And when I make cards, I put them in plastic bags for protection. So I ordered 200 of those bags. And I just make my card, put an envelope in there with it, and then put it into a bag. So everything is together. Sometimes I'll make matching envelopes. Sometimes I'll just leave them plain like... Sometimes my matching envelopes might be made out of the same paper as the card base. Sometimes the matching envelope is something that I stamp that's similar to what's in the card. And then I ordered two packages of plain envelopes, Colombian. And I have to put these prices on the screen for you. I can't remember what I paid on Amazon. So those are the two items that came from Amazon. So that is it for this haul. I'll come back with the video opening up the paper pumpkin box from June 2017. And then I will also show you how I am assembling the caddy. I'll see you in my next video. So thank you for watching. Bye bye for now.